Hey everybody, what's poppin? And when I say what's poppin, I'm not talking about boost pipes, blow off valves, or dump valves. I'm just saying like, hey, what's happening guys? Yeah, cool, so I just wanted to run through this with you. Uh, we spoke about my dodgy dealings with the TDO4 turbo. My real turbo that I really wanted to get hold of is a bit of a bit of a bigger one than the TDO4. I've only procured the exhaust housing for it, which I thought I would share with you. Here it is. But if I back, I found out about a GP Turbo on the Turbo Zentrum website. Guys in Europe might know because it's they've got a warehouse in Germany and in the UK. And they're quite big. And it was curious that the turbo that I wanted had a that was a 0.83 housing from the factory. He also had an option of a 0.75 in T3. So what I did is I clicked on it and it said AGP. So I was like, okay, well let's go Google search AGP turbo housing. It comes across that they are in Arizona, America. They got a really awesome Instagram page, and it was the one I wanted because of the smaller AR on the housing. What it is essentially is a three inch V band outlet, which will make it a nice, easy job for exhaust fabrication, etc. Um, 70 mil housings, it's a divided manifold. T3, a proper T3, T3 flange, and T3 ports. And you can actually see the divide, hopefully. You can see like the divided outlet over there, and you can see where each scroll will come into the picture as it just comes in over there if you can see it maybe it's in the class of turbo sizes like i would say maybe a gtx 3067 be a gtx 35 series probably but i would say definitely the gtx 30 frame so it's it's a small frame turbo but it's it's getting on the bigger side of things what i thought was in the beginning that uh, the turbo that i chose uh, was a bit big. It is a big turbo that we've just seen. The factory manifold or exhaust housing is 0.83 AR, the T4 twin scroll. I was really, really lucky in this case. There's a guy on YouTube um, who's got a, a 2JZ 2.5, sorry, a 1JZ 2.5 liter. And he's got this exact same turbo running with the exact same T4 twin scroll 0.83 AR. He's got a video where he has his rev counter and his boost gauge all in one frame. So you can kind of watch it slowly and see where, at what RPM, that turbo starts spooling. So on the green over there, we've got like turbo bar reading at 2,400 RPM, 0 0.1 at 2,600, 0 0.2 at 3,000, 0 0.3 at 3,100. So from that, we can calculate the exhaust flow per minute based on the fact that it's a four-stroke engine and it's got 2.5 liters of a displacement. I really wanted to compare, like, how how will my motor respond? It's a smaller motor, like half the size. How is it going to respond with that same size turbo? So basically, using the calculation in flow per minute, uh, I've calculated that I need almost double, almost double the RPM, probably a bit more than double. I'll, so on the, on the 2.5 liter, you're going to get 2,400 and zero on the boost gauge on my motor i'll get 4450 and zero but now that's for the eight the point eight three ar t t twin scroll i've got a slightly smaller a to r ratio so based on a further bit of research and watching a bit of youtube i've deduced that there's going to be a rev uh it's going to spool up th about 325 rpm better than th than the actual um factory one so this AGP turbo that I just showed you, you're going to start reading 0.1 bar at 4,500 approximately, uh, 0.2 at 5,200. So by the time, yeah, so we'll almost be running like a bar at point, uh, almost a bar at 6,500 RPM. Um, like I said, I'm going to be building up a higher RPM engine, so I'm not worried. Like this boost, boost will happen from about 4,000 onwards. So I'm not I'm not worried about it being too laggy or spooly, but yeah, just wanted to sh share that with you um, and just see what you guys think of this sort of turbo setup. Closing, I'd like to say thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing. Drop me any comments you want. If you wanted me to do a turbo match for you and, and a little dyno chart, by all means, DM me on Instagram. I'll I'll sort you out with something. Um, until next time, peeps. See you later.